Yo, everybody, welcome back to another episode of Minigame Skyblog. Ladies and gentlemen, we are here for, I think, episode number five or four already. I already have lost track, but thank you, everybody, for clicking on today's episode. I promise to make sure this one's going to be a good one because, ladies and gentlemen, we have discovered a game-breaking farm that you guys can use in Minecraft Skyblog, and I am going to teach you how to make it, how to use it, how to properly do it to its best fully function it's gonna be insane i hope you guys are excited we have spent a lot of time on this episode so do me a big favor guys if you guys are new drop a like on today's episode make sure you guys are subscribed and in celebration of episode number five going out i'm gonna be doing a 3,000 coins giveaway on today's episode and if you guys do not know what coins are they are the in-game currencies which allows you to buy cosmetics a crate and pets and mounts and all this cool stuff so 3,000 coins to the person who goes ahead and comments down there i IGN and answers this question for me. The question is, what is your favorite Minecraft mob and why? That's literally it. That's all you guys gotta do. So do that really quick for me. So do that really quick for me. And once you guys have done that, I will be picking the winner inside of the Discord as well. So make sure to go ahead and join the mini game Discord link down below in the description. You can either find it in the description or the top of the description. I meant comment section, top of the comment section. You'll find it down there somewhere. But yeah, literally super simple. Comment your IGN, make sure to answer that question and join the Discord. That's all you guys gotta do. And now that all of that stuff is out of the way, I think we should go ahead and head on over to the island really quick and get started with this farm, boys, because you guys are probably wanting to see that. So I'll see you guys on the island. Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen, we are here on the island. And as a little update, I have to show you guys what's going on, what's brand new and all this good stuff. So yeah, so here we are. We are on the island. And as you guys can see, the grinder isn't really anything different. The island hub is not different at all. Our wheat farms are still here. And over here, we do have a little bit of a grinder set up, but this is just temporary. We're making really, really good money with our IGs and whatnot. But there is something making a lot more money than, yes, this, the iron golems, 86 iron golems of Zion at once there is something doing better and that is right behind me and i am just gonna go ahead and show you so here we go boys don't worry i'm gonna teach you how to do it because it's a little more complicated than just this so as you guys can see this is a wheat farm that we have gone ahead and purposely made the way we made it now as you guys can see there are intricate parts to this wheat farm to make it as maximum efficient as possible and you're probably wondering to yourself well how am i gonna do that swear how how do you plan on teaching us how to build this i am going to do that by building a small little section that you guys can go ahead and copy slow down the video for yourself and remember when you actually build this you can do the same thing and repeat the process so i'm gonna build one chunk of it at a time and show you how to do it but there's a little bit more that goes into it than just building the farm so if we come over here really quick we can actually see mr apple the guy on my island he's the actual creator of this design for the farm so i'm gonna just go ahead and just kind of show you him and how it works so basically how it works is you have a little mine cart right you have a little mine cart look at him go and five blocks is the maximum amount of blocks that you guys or four blocks on five four blocks is the maximum amount of blocks that you can mine in front of you so make sure to go ahead this is just mental notes to make make sure it's four blocks wide and now we're gonna go ahead and kind of see what he's cooking with inside of his inventory so if i go ahead and do invis c mr apple really quick we can see that he has a level 20 yes guys if you guys have been watching the series we got the hoe to level 20 and i will show you the most important part about this tool uh, enchant over there that says auto sell yeah that means that he is automatically selling every single wheat that he goes ahead and actually collects and he's getting straight money so if we do slash bow mr apple really quick he has a hundred and ninety million dollars boys and if you guys don't understand how much that money that is that is 40 iron golems i think in our farm alone we have 90 so this is absolutely working like crazy it's it's pretty nuts to see how good it's actually working and there we go boys i just talked to mr apple as well he's gonna let us use the farm so so I can show you it in action. Here we go. So first off, we're getting to go ahead and actually buy some iron really quick. Uh, hang on. Let me go ahead and find it. It's an ore. We're going to need five, boys. We're going to need to craft our own little mine cart here. Oh, and there we go. He actually just gave us one. So here we go. Let's go ahead and put it down like this. And it's going to take us all the way around to the very start of the farm. Now, this is infinite. This is the most important thing is that this farm is infinite for us. So 
boom, we just started. And as we go, we're at $1.2 million really quick. And as you guys can see, we are already at $1.5 million. And look at this, boys. We actually have spawner finder on our harvester hoe, and we just found a creeper spawner. So I'll go over the enchants later and show you the ones that you guys need to actually be hitting. And boom, boys, we just got a crystal key as well. Oh my gosh. This method is super, super OP. So you're going to need to go ahead and listen up here. I'm going to go ahead and AFK this for 30 minutes to show you all the loot that I'm about to get. And then right after that, we are going to go ahead and multiply that by two to see how much we're making per hour. And then we're going to go into the tutorial for the farm. So I'm going to go ahead and hit this quick little mining session. And I will talk to you boys here in a bit. All righty, ladies and gentlemen, it has been 30 minutes exactly. And as you guys can see, we are at 80 million dollars. Oh my God. That is insane. I almost just dropped the harvester hoe, but we did not only just get 80 million dollars. We got so many spawners, including 12 iron golem spawners. So that is insane. That alone right there is 60 million plus 80 million. That is insane. So we're going to go ahead and go to shop really quick and also purchase a bunch of these so we can purchase if my math is correct i believe 18 of these things so let me go ahead and do that boom 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 oh wait it's 16 million okay well my math was not right boom there we go 16 igs and then we have 12 igs right there now i am going to go ahead and place all of these because i need to go ahead and mine them up so they all stack so i can go ahead and make this a lot easier there we go now we're gonna go ahead and mine them all up so they can go ahead and stack on each other and boom just like that we have 12 28 IGs, which is actually insane. So if I just go like this, boom, 28. And then if I go ahead and break it, boom, we have one spawner. That's 28 iron golems. Let's go down here. Oh my goodness. Okay, so they did this a little bit different, but I'm gonna go ahead and just add it right there. 48 IGs in that one. Holy cow. What are we on IS top? How many total do we have? Let's go ahead and check really quick. So IS top number one right now at 88 million total progress we are absolutely killing it on is top but the one thing that i want to check is okay so we have 190 so we're actually climbing pretty well and i believe mr apple is selling all of this automatically i think that's how chunk hoppers work on here and as we can see i think there's been over 800 million dollars total sold in this thing oh my god that is insane that's actually insane but we also have some other spawners here that we could probably add to the mix of things so if i come over here you know what i'm just actually gonna to save the rest of the spawners i'll go ahead and give the rest of the spawners to someone who comments down spawner and who is new to the server so if you guys are brand new to the server it's a good little head start that you guys can have i'll give you all of these spawners in my inventory it actually is quite a bit of spawners so good luck to whoever enters the spawner giveaway i'm gonna go ahead and put them into this chest right here so i don't forget boom over like 50 spawners right there for you guys but also guys i need to go ahead and put some of this stuff into my pv be really really quick because not only did we get uh what is it called a bunch of spawners but we also got a bunch of keys oh my gosh look at what we got we got crystal keys arcane keys and divine keys so let's go on over to spawn oh my gosh this is so many this is literally like i don't even know like this is definitely going to get nerfed so you guys need to go ahead and do this asap but let's go ahead and open these up so crystal keys let's go ahead and spam open these really quick boom 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 oh my gosh look at my screen man oh my goodness and boom there we go we got a ton more spawners cheese louise i'm gonna put everything we got inside of my pv number four just so we can look at it all at the end now we're gonna go ahead and open up the arcane keys here we go three two one boom 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 there we go oh my gosh look at all of this loot bro there is no way oh an op chunk collector nice and last but not least the divine keys here we go and for some some reason i can't actually open these up right here they're saying that the crates already open maybe i open up too many i gotta give it some time to cool off but i will go ahead and save these boys we also do have a couple of legacy crates that we need to go ahead and open up so let's open up these really quick to get some more gear and boom we got some more shields we got some hammers that's pretty good stuff honestly check it out boys look how much dungeon gear that we actually have that's insane okay let's go ahead and look at everything that we just got really quick here oh my god the amount of spawners i'm gonna go ahead and add that to the spawner giveaway for you guys except the igs because i think we're gonna go ahead and keep the igs boys but check it out there are so many spawners for you guys we also did get a ton of baits that we can go ahead and use but i don't know how good they're gonna be and then we also got a bunch 
of blocks that we can go ahead and add to the island and an op chunk collector that's really good so i'm gonna head on over to the island really quick here we go let me find this chest where is it at there it is okay boom and then let me go ahead and place these oh my gosh wait there we go okay so boom it oh, just it just takes a little bit to connect there we go and then i guess we don't have gold blocks so i'm just gonna start gold blocks right there now what you guys are probably gonna want to go ahead and see is the little tutorial that we're gonna go ahead and do now because i told you that i was gonna teach you how to build this step by step so let me go ahead and get everything in my inventory that we are going to need and then i will come back to you guys here in a bit okay guys i'm gonna go ahead and show you guys now how to do it over here so i'm gonna go ahead and tell you you need some dirt you need a mine cart you need some cobblestone you need some rails and you need some powered rail and then you need some water that's it that's literally all you need super easy stuff and we're gonna go ahead and just expand off of this one so the first thing that you guys are gonna want to go ahead and do for the first part of the farm is build a cobblestone line and i'm going to go ahead and build it let me go ahead and count here 10 blocks of cobblestone so you're going to want to go ahead and match it up just like this if you guys are looking at the other part of your farm 10 things of cobblestone and then what you're going to want to go ahead and do is then do four blocks of wheat like this so this is going to take 40 dirt and you're going to do make a four by ten dirt farm here and that's all that's literally all you have to do and then boom you are literally almost done so basically we're going to go ahead and continue this because this is the other side of the farm that the minecarts are going to go on them and then what you're going to want to go ahead and do i would personally use all powered rails and you always use powered rails on the straightaways the only time that you'll ever use normal rails are on these corners as you guys can see all of these corners have normal rails because powered rails cannot actually function so this is basically how you would do it is then you would do this right here and then come around on the corner with the normal rail and then do it like that easy easy peasy right now just for the sake of the video i am going to go ahead and cover up this with dirt just so our water doesn't flow out and then i'm also going to extend this one right here so boom bada bing now grab your water right here and you want to go ahead and place it one every 10 or eight rows so on this one it is on the 10 but what you're going to go ahead and do is make sure that there are eight blocks in between each one water source so there are eight blocks in between here and on the ninth and or on the first and tenth uh block you place some water and literally that's it all you guys got to do now is just hoe it down and plant your wheat seed so check this out grab your guys self a normal hoe and then what you're going to want to go ahead and do is just do this and this can actually work for any crop on the server by the way guys you guys want to join up the link for this server is down in the description below the ip it is both bedrock and java friendly so i would love to see you guys here and we actually don't have enough wheat seeds so let me go ahead and just mine these up really quick and then replant a little bit and then here we go so boom bada bing and we are done with the farm well kind of we're almost done we're almost done if i take a look underneath we have a lot of redstone torches that we're gonna need to go ahead and use here so i like to do it like this so on the outskirts just put one on your turn radius right here and then what you're gonna want to go ahead and do is come out one two three four five and then on the sixth block you'll go ahead and place your redstone so one two three four five and six boom yep that should line up perfectly and then let's go ahead and actually buy these redstone torches on the shop really quick there we go there they go for what 100 each that's not bad we're gonna need two for every single one so boom right there and then i believe i can just line this bad boy up and then go boom right there and if we come up here all of these should be powered and they are oh we actually forgot one extra one over here so let's go ahead and put that one right there boom and literally that's the farm now to see if you made it right go ahead and slap your minecart down and we're gonna go okay well we're probably gonna fall off the side of the mountain or i should say oh my gosh okay well bye my cart <laughs> but there you have it boys that's literally the it. and then you just kind of just continue this entire row all the way down to the edge of the island and just make sure to circle it back around and for instance say you're gonna continue to do another row instead of connecting it down on that end you'll go ahead and literally just go like this boom 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 and then turn the farm this way and go the opposite way it's actually really really simple and easy once you guys do it you'll understand feel free to watch this part of the video back if you do want but ladies and gentlemen oh my goodness gracious this is a ton of progress
progress from the last video. We are making strides. And as I told you guys, we are the number one island. Our island level is 195, which is absolutely insane. Look at our prices. Look at our worth just going up crazy. But anyways, guys, that's going to complete today's episode. Sorry if it was a little bit on the shorter end. I did really try to do a pretty good job of explaining and showing you this guy's meta. But if you guys did enjoy, make sure to go ahead, join the server right now. I would love to see you guys on. And after all that being said, boys, I love you all. I'll catch you guys in tomorrow's episode. Peace out and goodbye.